introducing the commercialization phase of Solomon batteries. With the imminent increase in the cost of lithium ion batteries, the price of lithium has surged from $4,450 per ton in 2012 to $78,032 in 2022. That marks an astounding increase of 1,654% over the past decade, with a 480% surge in just the last year. Now, envision a groundbreaking battery that costs a mere $15 per kilowatt hour, a stark contrast to the $101 per kilowatt hour of a lithium-based battery. This marks the revolutionary innovation presented by CALT. But what makes this battery's cost so remarkably low, and what additional advantages does it bring? Find out all this and more in today's episode of Tesla Car World. Welcome back to our channel, friends. Before we delve into today's content, please express your support by subscribing if you haven't already and ringing the bell, ensuring you won't miss any of our future engaging videos. Battery technology is advancing rapidly and keeping pace can be a challenge. However, KTL has strategically established an extensive supply chain for these batteries. Negotiations are underway with several car manufacturers to explore the possibilities of using sodium ion batteries. Sodium ion technology is not only cost effective and safe, but also poses the question, can it outperform the pricing of existing alternatives? Elon Musk tweeted that the price of lithium has reached insane levels. So how does the price of a sodium ion battery compare? The absolute advantage of sodium ion lies in its low cost as sodium constitutes 2.3% of the world's crust, making it over a thousand times more abundant than lithium. From the perspective of raw materials for anodes, the recent price of lithium carbonate is $570,000 per ton, whereas sodium carbonate is priced at less than $3,000 per ton. This makes it 190 times cheaper than a lithium ion battery. Cadhell even stated that sodium has better conductivity and the concentration of the electrolyte can be reduced, thereby reducing the cost by about 85%. These advantages, combined with sodium ion batteries being more commonly found and cheaper, make them a compelling option. However, despite these advantages, the average price of a Tesla 4680 battery pack is projected to be $101 per kilowatt hour in 2022. Using this figure, the new battery cost can be calculated at approximately $15 per kilowatt hour, nearly seven times less than the 4680 battery. So if you own a Tesla Model 3 standard range with an estimated battery capacity of 50 kilowatt hours, instead of paying $5,050 for a revolutionary game-changing battery, the cost is significantly lower. Now let's explore the performance of sodium ion batteries. Applications in passenger cars have demonstrated that they generally meet the needs of models with a range of up to 248 miles. Through pioneering AB battery system integration technology, KTL has achieved a blend of sodium ion and lithium ion, allowing them to complement each other and increase the energy density of the battery system. This approach enables sodium ion batteries to support EV models with a range of up to 310 miles, surpassing the 4,680 model Y's range of 279 miles. Despite these advancements, charging time remains a critical factor for electric vehicles. What duration would it take to charge a sodium ion battery? Kia tells sodium ion cells can achieve an 80% charge in just 15 minutes at room temperature. For comparison, a Tesla Model Y recharged from 0 to 80% in 30. 32 minutes at a public station, which is more than twice as long as the sodium ion battery. How well does the sodium ion perform in freezing temperatures? Lithium ion batteries function optimally within a temperature range of 15 to 35 degrees Celsius, causing issues in wintertime. KTL sodium ion battery maintains a 90% capacity retention rate at minus 20 degrees Celsius and still retains over 70% capacity at minus 40 degrees Celsius. In winter, the problem of electric vehicles' inability to cruise will no longer be apparent. Moreover, there is no significant degradation at higher temperatures. How safe are sodium ion batteries? Now, considering the safety of sodium ion batteries, they operate on similar principles as lithium ion batteries, with sodium ions shuttling between the cathode and a node. 
However, sodium ions have a larger volume and higher requirements for structural stability and kinetic properties compared to lithium ions, posing a bottleneck for industrialization. Sodium ion batteries are deemed safer due to their lower flammability compared to lithium ion batteries. The newly developed sodium ion technology incorporates a naturally fire extinguishing solution resistant to temperature changes, operating at high voltages. The ultra-thin protective layer on the anode remains stable once formed, contributing to the long cycle life mentioned in the research article. What are they exactly now? Despite significant breakthroughs, the chemical composition of lithium metal batteries has consistently presented numerous challenges. Now, I comprehend that sodium ion batteries exhibit a lower energy density compared to lithium ion batteries. The significant drawback lies in their reduced energy density, implying that an electric vehicle, EV, equipped with a sodium battery of the same dimensions as a standard lithium ion battery would not cover as much distance on a single charge. KTL's initial sodium battery model produces 160 watt hours of electricity, in contrast to a mainstream lithium battery. Last year, KTL introduced its inaugural sodium battery prototype and announced its focus on advancing technologies for a second generation sodium battery capable of generating 200 watt hours per kilogram. In comparison, mainstream lithium ion batteries typically offer 200 to 300 watt hours per kilogram. Despite ongoing improvements in their lower energy density, the first generation of sodium ion batteries surpasses the performance of lithium ion cells from six or seven years ago. In terms of real world applications, the type of applications in which these batteries are utilized makes a difference. The initial generation of sodium ion batteries finds utility in various transportation electrification scenarios, particularly in regions with extremely low temperatures, where their exceptional advantages become apparent. Furthermore, they can be flexibly adapted to the specific application requirements in the energy storage field. It is noteworthy that while numerous new battery technologies are under investigation in laboratories, the transition from lab research to market availability often takes 5 to 10 years. In conclusion, the prospect of sodium ion batteries hitting the market seems promising with significant strides made by both the US and China, along with the notable entry of the battery company ATL, set to commence production in 2023. This development is a substantial leap towards diversifying battery options beyond the prevalent lithium ion technology. While lithium ion batteries are likely to persist in high-end market vehicles, the emergence of sodium ion batteries signifies a revolutionary shift for everyday applications. The cost effectiveness and viability of sodium ion batteries present a compelling alternative, marking a potential turning point in the electric vehicle industry. The question remains, when will sodium ion batteries become readily available to consumers? Anticipating their widespread adoption may take some time, but the advancement suggests that sodium ion batteries could eventually become the mainstream choice for everyday use. In essence, the introduction of sodium ion batteries is as groundbreaking as the inception of electric cars themselves. As we look ahead, the market may witness a transformative shift towards more economical and sustainable energy storage solutions. Thank you for watching and your continued support. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and stay tuned for exciting developments in the realm of electric vehicles and green technology. Until next time, take care and stay safe. If you enjoyed our video, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more content. Thank you.